Today we're making neck bones with potatoes and a side of mac and cheese. If you like to learn how to make this simple comfort food, stay tuned. Yes, we are making neck bones and a simple macaroni and cheese as a side dish. Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. I'm just simply T. To make neck bones with potatoes, you need, of course, neck bones, broth, brown gravy packs, onions, potatoes, seasonings to your liking, and a slow cooker. All right, guys, so first up, you want to cut some onions and some potatoes. Since I'll be adding the potatoes later, I'm gonna put them in cold water so they wouldn't turn brown. All right guys, so here I'm adding the neck bones to the crock pot and applying simple seasonings. Pepper, salt, onion powder, and garlic powder. So here I'm ready to add my onions, then my beef broth, but you can use vegetable, you can use chicken broth, it's up to you. Here I'm adding my two brown gravy packs. Now I'm ready to cook my neck bones. Since I want them nice and tender, falling off the bone goodness, I'm gonna cook them for five to six hours on high. At the three hour mark, I'm gonna stir and add my potatoes and stir again. Now onto my lazy version of mac and cheese. I already cooked the noodles and I'm going to add milk, eggs, and butter. Normally with macaroni and cheese, I make a cheese sauce with heavy cream, smoked gouda, Vermont, and mozzarella cheese, but this is the quick lazy edition. So I add a block sharp cheddar cheese that I cut into pieces, macaroni and cheese, and a mozzarella cheese bag. Here I'm adding sour cream, pepper, paprika, stirring all that goodness together. Now 
I'm topping it with cheese and placing it in an oven for 400 degrees for 30 minutes since it's a small dish. The mac and cheese is done. Alright guys, I'm done. I did cook some rice and green beans as an additional side item. I hope you enjoyed this simple Sunday dinner comfort food recipe. I'm Lady T and I will catch you in the next video. Have a great week. Be blessed. Bye.